PerfectGuitar.com. 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 You're gonna eat it. Thanks for plugging in to the Perfect Guitar. Uh, we'd like to welcome you all out today to our brand new headquarters in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. We're here today with the next big singer, songwriter, and guitar player uh, in the country music scene, David St. Romain. He's a Baton Rouge native. We're glad he's here today uh, to do our first episode of the Perfect Guitar Podcast. Hope you enjoy. All right, so Davis, tell us a little bit about growing up in Baton Rouge and the music scene in Baton Rouge. Yeah, I actually moved here in high school and finished high school here in Baton Rouge. And as soon as I turned 18, I started playing in the country music scene here in Baton Rouge, which is fairly limited. You think that was kind of an advantage to stand out, I guess, regionally, that there's not a huge country scene around South, South Louisiana? Um, actually, I, th I think it made it a little more difficult. Uh, it made things difficult for me. It made me alter my uh, set list a lot. It also made it difficult to find musicians. Did you start off playing guitar? Were you originally a guitar player I mean, from the get-go? Uh, well, you know, I was actually originally a singer from the get-go, but I mean, I started playing guitar at 10. Uh, my dad was a singer, not professionally, but just in the house, and in the car. And so I was able to you know, learn from him. And then he also played a little guitar, so it was helpful you know, having him you know, teach me the G and the C and the D. We can take our time, because we got time. Time for whatever crosses our mind. Just, I mean, I was writing as a kid, but really just in the last five years, I think I've really focused a lot of, of my efforts on writing. I'm really a, a melody guy, and, and, a, and obviously being a vocalist, and a, you know, melody is where I'm strong at. I like to have a great lyricist involved, because what happens is, without a great lyric, you can have tons of progressions in music and, and it can be killer music but you gotta have a great lyric as, as, especially in country music and I just typically sit down with a guitar sometimes it's six in the morning when I've driven back from a show and I'm a little delirious and that's sometimes when I get my best writing done is when my brain has been washed through and through and I'm, I'm tired as can be oh, oh, after Tell us how that all, all got started, um, you know, where did that come from? A drummer uh, by the name of Billy Block, who has a uh, promotional show in Nashville called uh, Billy Block's Western Beat, he uh, hosts uh, auditions every year for the show. He called me and said, look, I'm doing a private audition, would you like to be a part of it? And there's going to be about 20 people and the producers of the show. And So I went to Houston, did the audition, three months later, two months later, got a call for to saying that I would... I had made the regionals and went to the semifinals, and then from there went to the, got on the show. Well, I was born in this little town, perfect place for settling down. There's another life, one that's calling me. We all became friends. Cowboy Troy, literally, I'm going to see him Monday. We're flying to Vegas and we're going to hang out with Blake and Anastasia and Troy and John Rich. And they, their doors are wide open to me now because of the show. And people don't realize that. They think, oh, you just get on the show and you, you get a record deal no matter what. No, there's a lot of work. There's a lot of work. I work, I work a lot harder now than I ever worked in my whole life. Um, if you think that, that it's a success overnight, you're wrong. It's literally, I'm on the first step. Not even, I hadn't even made it to the first step of the ladder. Another dollar earned Day after day This four wheels turn Our coordinator, uh, Allison Had the worst job on the whole show She had the worst job 
six weeks into the show, Randy came in to do a rehearsal for Mountain Music. I watched her walk over to him and give him a big old hug. And he kind of sidetracked me because I, I never knew for the first six weeks that that was his daughter. We had already became friends. We had already began a great relationship as friends. She turns out is to be Randy's daughter and it like blew me away. She had just told me for the last six weeks that her mother and her brother and her sister were voting for me and that they all believed that I was going to win the show. And to come find out, that's Randy Owens' family that was voting that's for voting for me. So every time he would go home, his wife's in there, you know, talking about me and telling telling him that, yeah, I'm voting for David. And so that's, that's been my favorite thing. And I, I hope to continue that relationship with him and, and with his family. And, and with other people like that, you know, people that 72 million records sold, 42 number one country hits. You know, that typically, it's not something, you know, I'm not thinking all money, I'm thinking, you know, this guy's got a lot of experience. Unbelievable mentor. I couldn't ask for a better person to be able to learn from. So that's been my best experience. It's gonna be evening. Oh, all afternoon. Sun outside Might as well be the moon Oh, between these sheets And your sweet perfume It's gonna be evening Oh, all afternoon Perfectguitar.com 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 Perfectguitar.com